What's going on, YouTube? This is your neighborhood DraftKings addict, bringing my top picks for Tuesday's main MLB DraftKings slate. All right, guys, we have a 12 games uh, on today's uh, slate, guys. But as you can see on the screen, guys, it's tax day. All right, it's the deadline for you guys to file your federal tax returns. All right, guys, get it done. You don't want the IRS on your back, okay? All right, so if you can't file your taxes by tomorrow, guys, if you haven't done so already, File for an extension, guys. Be smart about it. Avoid any penalties. You know, that's money that you could have to play DFS. All right, guys? So, also in your local area, you're going to have some deals for tax day, guys. You know, Sonic has all kinds of deals in some other places. But, you know, check out your, your local places, guys. You might be able to find a good deal at lunchtime. All right, tomorrow. So, all right. Before we get into today, today's picks, guys, let's talk about Draft Dashboard, guys. So, this is the app that I use to do a lot of my MLB research, guys. So, keep it short and sweet. In the description of this video, it's a seven-day trial for one buck. If you go and use the link in my description, if you go in there, sign up, and then you go to the Watch Player tab in your screen and click on Watch DK Addicts Picks, my picks will load into your screen, and you will have my personal player pool for that day. And then you can go ahead and put in the plays you like, go into the lineup, optimize, and let it spit you out of the lineup, guys. So that's Draft Dashboard. Give it a look. All right, so. On the screen, guys, you're going to have my top plays for the day, guys. We're going to keep it short and sweet. This is my second time recording this video because my dumb software decided it didn't want to record the audio on the first take. So I'm going to have to go through it again. But let's make it work, guys. So Corey Kluber, man, I'm paying, him up, paying up for him, guys. He's 12K for a reason. This guy has upside. As you can see, versus Detroit, he put up 46 DraftKings points. All right, 13Ks. It's insane. All right, but. I like him versus Minnesota. Now, Minnesota's a tough team. You know, they, if they get their hands on the ball, guys, he could lead apart. But they also can strike out. So, I like Kluber. He has a nice history versus his team. Lock him in. I'm paying up that pitcher, guys. As you can see, my, my SP2 is Patrick Corbin. Again, he's playing at home, but I like him. He's playing against San Francisco. All right, in San Francisco, as you can see, he only scored 20 DraftKings points, but he's at home, and uh, he tends to pay better at home. Uh, I guess he gets behind the home crowd, but – I like Patrick Corbin at the moment for my SP2 guys. So, all right. So, if you don't like Kluber, guys, you got a couple options on the screen, man. But, uh, like, Lester, he's been trash. McCullough's been trash lately. Price is probably going to be injured. Who knows if he's playing. But he's going up against uh, the Angels. You know, Gonzalez, he had chances when he was looking good. But, you know, do you trust him at 8K? I don't know. So, I'm going to stick with the easy money. That would be Corey Kluber and uh, Patrick Corbin. But, Kurt Suzuki, guys. Now, this guy last year came out of nowhere, and he was hitting everything out the park, man. Bad at the bottom of the order. All right, so this guy's going to be right in the meat of the order, batting fifth, and I like him in his position, guys, in Atlanta. All right. He has a nice uh, Wobble versus the pitcher handed that he's facing, and he has a nice ISO, guys. So you see he already has two home runs, and he's starting to heat up. He had 31, 7, and 14, okay, in the last three games, guys. So he's starting to heat up. So I like him. He's batting. He's, well, he's projected to bat fifth. But I like Kurt Suzuki for the discount, and I like paying down at the uh, catcher position anyway. All right. Now, if you're not playing Kluber, guys, this is a nice BVP play. Mr. Mawa here, he has a nice history versus uh, uh, Kluber. All righty. So, again, just because, as you see right here, guys, Kluber's, Kluber's a righty, righty, and this guy here is a lefty. All right. You know him. You can see the ball better. All right, when the, uh, the guys are opposite handed. And so clearly he's seeing it well because he has a few hits against Kluber in a couple of times that he's uh, faced him. Now, small sample size, but it still shows that he's clearly seeing whatever Kluber's throwing. So I like Mauer if you're not going to go with Kluber, guys. All right. Now, Scooter Gannett, that's a guy here that has the ability to put up some nice points, guys. He's starting off kind of slow. All right. But as you can see, he's starting to heat up a little bit here. All right. But he's playing in Milwaukee, Extreme Hitters Park. All right. Again, he has a nice split versus the uh, pitcher that he's uh he's facing, uh, lefty righty. But um, again, I like Scooter in this position because again, he has a nice ISO. You know how, how hard he can hit the ball, and in Milwaukee, it can lead apart, guys. So let's make it work. All right. Next up, Villanueva. Again, another guy with insane Woba and ISO. All right. Versus the pitcher, uh, Wood. I played him the last time he he started, and he played like shit. Excuse my French. But, uh, yeah, so I'm attacking him. All right. I know it's in San Diego and Extreme Pitchers Park and all that good stuff, right? But look at this game versus San Francisco. All right, this is in San Diego, and he put up 
home run in the last two games. So I like this Villanueva the way of a kid. Again, has a nice ISO versus the pitcher that he's facing. And uh, hey, I'm locking him in at 3.3K. He's cheap. He helps me afford the pitchers. I'm expecting about 65 to 70 DraftKings points from my pitchers. All righty. And then my batters, you know, that'll just be gravy on the biscuit. All right. So George Springer, all right. He has another lefty matchup, lefty righty matchup, guys. And uh, just play him when he's playing the lefty. All right. Like tonight on Monday's main slate, he had a home run a day, leadoff pitch. All right. Well, leadoff hit, you know, got a home run. So I like Springer. Chances of hitting the home run, he's batting first, which means he's going to have a couple of chances to swing at it. And again, he does well versus the pitcher hand and that he's facing, guys. So I like Springer for my outfielder. All right. I wouldn't chase Bryce Harper. You know, he did well today. But hey, good luck if you do. All right. But I'm not chasing it. I'm going with George Springer. I'm chasing that one. All right, guys. So that's my top plays for tomorrow, guys. If you want my personalized player pool, again, drive dashboard. Link is in the description. Seven day trial for one buck. All right, good luck tomorrow, guys. Get your taxes done, guys. Like I say, you don't want the IRS in your backyard, guys. All right. So good luck on tomorrow, guys, and I'll holler at you on the next video.